Spiders, it's Wednesday, and I've just finished reading what is probably not maybe word-wise, especially the longest book that anyone's done for book fighters, but I think it's probably the biggest size wise. Let's see. It's Van Gogh the Complete Paintings, but it has words too. Like actually quite a bit of them. I can't find a particularly wordy page right now because I'm flipping past all of them. But yeah, this book is heavy. Um, it's not portable. I read it all on my futon because I couldn't even move it that much. Um, so the really interesting thing about this book is not just the paintings. And this is actually one of the only editions that has pretty much all the paintings that are known that the accreditation is definitely, they were definitely Van Gogh paintings, and then there are some that the owners wouldn't allow them to reproduce in color. But it has all of his paintings in full color. Well, I think it's something like 80% of his paintings in full color, um, which a lot of the earlier versions of Van Gogh's work were not in full color. But I need to talk about the words, because it's book fighters. Um, Copyright. I haven't talked about copyright in forever. Mostly because I got so annoyed with art school and stuff. Copyright. Pretty fucking awesome. Ha 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 ha. Um. Yeah. I know I talked about this before when Dan asked that question about theater and I was like, ha ha, no. I don't know anything about theater. I'm going to talk about art instead. Um. And also Doctor Who. But, yeah, so, I've spent a lot of time looking through this book, but I had never actually read it, actually read pretty much any of the actual writing in it, especially not the whole way through. So it's really interesting to go through that, because it, it's not just a biography of Van Gogh's life, but there are also excerpts from some of his letters, and I really want to, at some point, get a book, or more likely volumes of books that have all of the letters unedited because they're really interesting. There were some really fantastic quotes from them. Like oh, where is it? Like one that I really liked. In the introduction there's this essay about two of his paintings that are in this chair. This is a crappy little look at these. Um, this is Paul Garden's armchair, and then this is the Van Gogh painted, and then in this one, Van Gogh painted his own chair. And then this whole essay in the front piece is about these two paintings. They're set together, and random thing in here that annoyed me is the Pain Van Gogh's chair in London and the other one is in, I believe, Amsterdam. They kind of really fit together, it's just like, wish they were in the same museum, but they're not. Um, so that's what they're for. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, he's talking about He's talking about his parents and he's talking about Charles uh, Dickens and what he said is his parents does not mean if the old attitude for a certain
One by one, as of what I can appreciate, so to be on its own, which is me, but yeah, there's also a reason to know things about Pakistan and then be what their group is saying about them. Thank you.